let's I guess I will do the eat and run again because we didn't do we didn't get the delirium unfortunately but I just didn't feel all that powerful so I didn't want to Ooh, hell oh space bar I didn't feel all that what is that huh huh hello I just didn't feel that strong so I didn't really want to rush into hush to guarantee the delirium run but what is this item that I take took shards of glass seems like my body is bleeding but anything other than that it's not doing anything did you ever audition for professional orchestra jobs hell yeah I did there are audition uh, videos on my YouTube channel actuality and one of the most recent ones <laughs> they're like all the audio of this video is copyrighted uh, material I don't know how cuz like Brahms been dead for so long I don't know how he has copyright in it but who knows anyways they're like this video is not available in every country and I'm just like Jesus Christ in this whole world in this whole world I was kind of offended and it was even like you know the whole soundtrack of the orchestra playing in the background or anything like that it was just audition tape like audition excerpts like you you saw it with the tambourine audition tape uh, audition excerpts it's not the whole piece it's just within that piece there is like a huge solo for an instrument so they need to take so they will take that solo out and then put it into an excerpt so that will be the thing that they will audition uh, the, uh, for the people and there was like Beethoven and I thought Beethoven was not copyrighted because he's been dead for so long I thought it was like a public domain even some of the Tchaikovsky pieces is public domain right I know like many of Mozart's pieces are public domain just because because like there's like a law of how long can a material be how long for a material be uh, copyrighted for states to, to stay copyrighted material I guess like if the material is it's like over 200 years old or something like that it loses its own copyright and becomes public domain something like that I don't know but I'm just like that's why some of the pieces that you see like a classical music it becomes public domain and most of times if you, you can get the music for free but I was like well the Mozart <laughs> excerpts got flagged <laughs> it's not even like you cannot monetize no 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 <laughs> you cannot like if you were to play that video you will hear no audio but there is like super old audition videos on my youtube and it's just like me actually like i because like it's like the video audition tapes and then after you go through it maybe you will do the live auditions depends on the orchestra but anyways um i have many of them and then i decided to make some of them public because it's like, hey, you know, I don't know. Some people might find it interesting. And they'll be like, Kate, I don't... Like, you know, oh, you say you're oboist. How good are you? I bet I'm better than you or something. I don't know. I'm just like, well, here's me playing. And then uh, when I auditioned about two years ago, I think. About two years ago. I ranked number four, like top four in Canada so like or for youth so anyone who is under 26 years old they were able to audition like if they are 26 or younger they that was the um, age group that people were able to audition and within that I ranked top four in Canada so I think I'm pretty good but yeah I just stopped auditioning because it's really stressful and you have to fly all the time and 
if I fly to audition, then you guys will miss me and be like, Hey, where's the videos? Where are the streams? And I'll be like, I'm sorry, I'm flying to blah to audition. So I just kind of like, yeah, I just... It's alright. Auditioned many, many times. <laughs> In my younger ears. <clears throat> But there's also my third year uh, in my when when I was in university. There's also third year recital, Martinu Obo Concerto, and Martinu Obo Concerto is known as one of the hardest Obo Concerto ever written. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There's like. One piece that is the hardest piece for oboe, but Martinu is like second hardest. Played it on my third year, and I said that's pretty good. And I think many people say like, "Oh, you're pretty good," but the pianists weren't that good, or your accompanist wasn't that good. And I'm just like, you know, I feel bad for her. The piano part for that piece is ridiculously difficult. So she couldn't play, you know, the best she could. So I feel for her. But... Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. If you want to hear, like, if you have time... Ooh, what the hell? You jumped, but then you didn't jump, what? Yo, you still did not jump. Oh, you still did not. Like, you keep jumping into your own spot. So I'm just kind of confused. But maybe because the monster is confused. That's why it's doing that. Um, but if you have time to kind of like, hey, I want to listen to something that is not pop song or whatever that you usually listen, give Martinu, M-A-R-T-I-N-U, Obo, O-B-O-E, Concerto, C-O-N-C-E-R-T-O, Martinu, Obo, Concerto. It's pretty... It's pretty dope. I think many people will find it kind of entertaining to listen to because just because of the sheer difficulty and you know how people just like what? I don't know anything about that instrument, but that seems really hard is that piece. So I think people hey oh wow why yo Why do you have all the different types of brimstones, yo? Maybe you could just like stick with one and it will help me out, my friend. Sure, better than the ped. Who uses ped? You know, nowadays, people use a tampon or the cup. Dude, I would like to have an LS for females. Like, it doesn't have to be females. There could be males and stuff. But like, I would like to have co-hosts of females but like one <laughs> one of my friends actually told me this but i think it's 100 percent. i don't know why and i'm sad that i agree with her but for a female to be friend with another female their friendship has to instantly click to 100 percent, or they will just never become a friend and i'm just like i hate you know what i hate this one i hate to agree with you but it's 100 percent true if you don't 100% click with the female friend who is, especially in your adult lifehood, like, you know, when you're a kid, I don't think it really matters, but like, adult female to be friend with another adult female, you have to like instantly click, then you become BFF. Then you become like, oh my gosh, we cannot live. It's like sisters before bros, that kind of close friendship, but then if two adult females don't click right away they're like yeah she's all right but she's not really my friend i just kind of like know her and it's like it's so true it's so hard for females to be friend with another adult female friend it's i don't know why it's just it's just way it is and then for a male it's just like you just give any other dude to another dude as long as they share similar hobby they're like instant bffs I'm just like, that's so true! 
It's so true. They're like, oh, you're you into video games? And they'll just talk about it. But even for female to female, they're like, oh, you into video games? And even like specific video games, they're like, yeah, she's all right, but not really my friend. I don't know. It, it felt true when my friend said that. And I'm just like, it's true. Because like, I, for one, don't really have female friends. I think it's really difficult to have female friends. No, oh, you die. Never mind. But on the other hand, I have many male friends. No. Oh, sure. Let's use it. Hey, Mask of Infamy. I like it. Wait, I saw chat saying the cup question mark. You guys, what? How do you? I guess if you're a dude, you don't know. You don't know? So for like woman, there there are three different ways to to I guess like go through your period. Ow. One is the pen. One is tampon. And third is the cup. You don't know? How do you not know? Don't they teach you? Why won't they teach you this? Do don't you guys have like sex ed? Yeah, the cop. I have never heard about the cop. Are y'all trolling me? How do you how has how do you guys like live under the rock? You should like totally see it in in when you go buy like tissue. You know, usually they group the bathroom tissue with Woman product. I don't know why even woman product even sounds so stupid. Woman product. <laughs> Ooh, I actually like the candle. No, please. Oh my god, you actually went through the gap. It's like so. Okay, so those of you who don't know, it's like there are var various names for it. There's some called like Diva Cup. Wow. Mask of Infamy! Please work! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. But like... That's the company. Oh, hell yeah. Mm, hell yeah. It's called Diva Cup. So instead of tampon, you just have the silicone... Uh... Cup. That's like... Obviously, super tiny. And you basically use it like tampon, but instead of tampon, which is like, you know, cotton ball that soaks up blood, it's the cup where you you would just have your blood be contained in there until you take it out. And then you'd be like, isn't that more uncomfortable? No, it's it's as comfortable as tampon or even more comfortable but it's like not only healthier for your body so like for cotton the um it becomes like a pro 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 problem um because it's like a cotton and it's like a thing that a bacteria can grow within your body it becomes like if you keep it in there too long, uh, it actually there's like you can get shock from it. So you have to at least uh, change it every five to eight hours or something like that. Um, and for that incident, it only happened once. But because it happened once, 
they have to have the warning which i kind of it's like you know it makes sense you know one one too many times but it's not like the person died or anything it's just like it was a shock they got like ah and then they went to the hospital and they're all they're all good they're okay um Ooh, interesting. But then the cup, it's like the medical silicon material that it doesn't really breed any bacteria within your body. So it's safer and you don't even have to like clear it out every four to, you know, eight hours. You can actually clean it out every, uh, 12 hours, which is really good for a woman who has like super busy busy hours And it's also echo friendly as well cuz like what is this? Garbage atoms. I got shoot the whoop. I don't know man. They're both kind of like meh. Oh! So like cotton like a tampon, you know after you use it you throw away which becomes landfill so it's bad because a lot of you, like women, they don't just have like one period and that's it, you know. Like, they have many periods within their lifetime. I hate all these rooms. This, this sucks. This actually sucks. So it creates lots of waste. Lots of landfill. What is this? Why, 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 what did I do? Even the bosses sucks. Where for the diva cup is like you you can use it oh my god the speed of that spider they say like you don't have to change into a new cup for like every five years or so so you big you can basically reuse that cup for five years like one cup for every five years which is like amazing <laughs> also it's pretty cheap like what, it's like $15, $18 for one diva cup or two. And you don't have to spend any money afterwards for five years. Which is pretty good. Like after you use it, you rinse it out. And then they recommend um, once a month, you should put it in like a hot water. Just to kill off, just basically kill, kill off any harmful bacteria living on the surface of it to basically eliminate the chance from 1% to 0% kind of thing but yeah so there well now you know it's like the now you know like the the rainbow gif can this thing open up please i've I, had, I, I, I don't like this. So when your female friend comes over and they whoop out their diva cup, you don't go, Oh, is that a shot glass? Ho <laughs> ho! She'll be disgusted by you, okay? <laughs> oh, let's... Oh, you brought your... Sh you, you brought your, uh, a shot glass to celebrate? She'll be disgusted. No, I'm just- Oh, wow! Stupid tear. Became a bomb. Can it be both? You're so disgusting, yo! Let's say have you have like- You shit in the cup? You wanna drink from that cup? Disgusting! Get out of here! Even the thought of thinking, can it be both? God, no! I mean, like, literally, it can be both. But, like, that is disgusting. Don't ever talk to me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Female friend feels bad. <laughs> well, I'm just saying, you know, I saved your awkward time. If that ever, you know, happens, you owe me a drink, alright? You owe me a, a good drink. Like, drink as beer, because I like beer. Um... And be like, hey, thank you. If it wasn't for you, I would have made a horrible joke or be like, what is that? And, you know, embarrass myself. But now I know 
I owe you a drink. And I'll be like, hell yeah, meet me at Pex West. I will take that drink. You know, I will never refuse free drink. Free, good beer. Bad beer, shitty beer? No, no, I pass. I don't, I would rather drink water. All right. Good beer, anytime. Let's go, the feather is good. Madrina coffee? Yo, yo, I don't... I don't drink coffee, okay? <laughs> I said beer. How do I feel about this? Oh, my soul heart. How do I feel about this run? I hate it. I actually hate this run. I don't like it. Damage is garbage. My... My tear. What is that tiny hand? I was about to make inappropriate joke, but I held myself back so I would not offend anyone. No. There's a rock tinto. Nope. Nope. Sure, I'll take damage up. We need a lot more. It's already 20 minutes. We're in depth too. Pretty much like on time, I would say. A little, little late for boss rush for sure. Can I, can, can you move the tear? Ah, we all know. All my soul heart. All that. Good stuff gone. Just I just hate it. <sighs> okay, you know what? It's, it's me who is bad. Also, I'm tilting. Ooh, let's go. How am I so rich? But I don't want it. Oh, we roll, we roll, we roll. Oh no. Okay, I want it, but recycle. I didn't see it, and obviously they took more than one penny to get rid of it, which makes me sad. Little, 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 little. Oh yeah, do you guys know? Do you guys know the Korean name for Squidward? I mean, who am I talking? Why would they know? <laughs> Even I didn't know. Until, like, I watched some of the Korean YouTuber mentioning the name, and I thought, that's hilarious! So you know how, like, he whines a lot? <laughs> Squidward, he whines a lot, you know? And... In Korean, if you, like, if you whine a lot, it's like, ching 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 -y. And that's his name. Squid word is ching chingy. <laughs> Cause he whines a lot. And I'm like, oh my god, that's hilarious. Ah! Mimic. Dude. Panda pants are actually new? Wasted. Panda pants are actually new. The name. I don't think it's Ching Jingy, I think it's Ching Jingy. Cause he, he whines a lot. <laughs> no. I don't, I don't like this run. Me don't like this run, please. What's the highest tier of whining? He was like, oh, that's not a that's a sandwich. <laughs> That's whining, dude. Oh, it's hot dog sandwich. Every every time, whenever he uses that ee sound in his voice, that's him whining. I'm just like, oh, there he goes. I actually want to. Tell you guys 
a story yesterday. I totally forgot. So I was sleeping, obviously. <clears throat> and then Ryan woke up earlier than me. Uh, cause he's a, he's in under pressure for preparing the backlog. Uh, cause we're going to Toronto to see his parents for a week. Actually more than a week. It's like eight days, nine days or something like that. So he's like under pressure to create backlogs. So he's waking up earlier than you usual and preparing for the backlog. And then, so he wake up earlier recording. So I often wake up with the sound of him recording. And I thought, Jesus Christ. And then yesterday, it was, usually it's normal, but yesterday I thought it was really funny because I, I woke up with the, woke, woke up with the topic of, or him talking about like, what kind of vagina is the good vagina? And I was like, did I hear that right or am I dreaming? And I just woke up with it and I just kind of like, I wonder how many women in this world wake up and wake up by the sound of their husband or their significant partner saying, what kind of vagina is a good vagina? And I'm just like, you know, first of all, why, why do you want to talk about that in the, you know, like 9 a.m.? I'm sure it's like a bit, but whatever. I just woke up with the, with him saying that, so I don't really have, I don't have any context. It is definitely out of context situation. Um, but he definitely said what kind of vagina is good vagina. And I was like, I'm like a little offended, but you know, maybe like, you know, what, what was he talking about? I don't really have the context. And then the, that was like the first second when I heard it. And then the second second that when I heard him saying that, I was just like, you know, he actually has a good, Good question. What kind of vagina is a good vagina, you know? You know, people have standard for their, you know, like, uh, the world maybe have, like, have some kind of standard on dicks. They go like, ah, small, tiny, thin dicks are bad. But then there is, like, no, there is no, like, standard on women's vagina. They don't go like, ah, small thin vaginas are bad there's there's no oh my god i got freaking aria wizard i ain't going anywhere with this thing i have to sit through nls no this wasn't nlss you thought i slept until like 2 p.m no 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 this was like him recording by himself at 9 a.m so he was i'm sure he was recording isaac video or something like that and you know he's like Maybe, maybe it was like the vagina monster in Isaac or something. And then he, he was just like, what kind of vagina is the good vagina? Wide vagina, a Larry David bit. That's true. We were watching, what was that show called again? Cur curiosity, something, something, something curiosity. And then it's just like, yo, I heard, your dick is like really tiny. And then it's like, no, that lady's vagina is, it's just like endless pit. It's just, yo, you know, nothing can reach the end of it. And I was like, uh -huh. you know, that wasn't funny. But then she actually stole the dude's cell phone. But then the implication was that she shoved it in her vagina. <laughs> and I'm just like, okay, I can see that was about how that's funny. I understand that joke. Curb your enthusiasm, that's it. I'm playing bad, I'm playing bad. I'm playing bad. Also, I'm not finding the boss room. Map layout sucks balls. Oh, the spider just squeezed through! So weird. Ah, oh, thank you very much for the cheer! No, 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 no run! But I guess women have, like, an easy... 
maybe like not may not easy, but we don't have that hard social pressure to think like is my vagina a good vagina? Most of vagina is is good enough. And also, you never know until it's if it's good or bad until you're you're in it, you know. And I'm just like, but then for dude, even. It's just like, by the look, you go, ah. Maybe the, excuse me, I didn't want to use that. I wanted to use the moon, but okay. Well, there, there goes my protection. No, it did not grab me. It did not grab me. Almost grabbed me. Oh my God. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Where do you from? What does that mean? Mm. English, please. Mm, where do you from? <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm actually... It actually makes me laugh. I hate this boss. How am I supposed to know where the spikes is gonna come out? No! Please. No. I'm so dead. The spikes are coming out. No. No. 